This is a short little video doing a little experimentation because I watched a demonstration by Don Emerson the other day on from the Red Rock Pastel Society. And you know I've been experimenting with the pan pastels. And I wanted to see some of the things that Dawn had to say. So I'm experimenting with something that she tried because I had some of the same materials. Mm -hmm. And here I have applied some Payne's Gray water-based oil paints with a soft brayer on my small sheet of Bristol vellum paper. And I didn't let it dry, but while it was still wet, I started to apply just a few colors of Pan Pastel. And I used kind of an old makeup sponge because I had one laying around and I didn't know how this was going to work. So I wanted to use something that I didn't care that much about. So wanted to see how this would work and it's a really fun experiment. Then I took a, an eraser and I went through some of the pan pastel and I could erase some of it and get to the oil beneath. And I thought, well, I wonder what's going to happen. I would have liked to have cut the eraser with a razor blade, but I need to go find one. I just thought I would see, and it looked like it was making some kind of a cool texture. So after I did that, then I went back over it with some more pan pastel to see what would happen. And it did create kind of a layer. So very interesting. Anyway, this has been a fun, short experiment, and I think I'll try this again a little more intentionally and see what I can do with it. Totally different surface. Now the pan pastels sticked, you know, stuck very well to the Bristol vellum paper. I don't think soft pastel would stick very well, but the pan pastel, the oil paint, uh, it worked quite well. So I may try it with something else in the future.